Hey guys, welcome back. It's Kelly from Keeping Money Jazzy. And in this video today, I will be breaking down my week one of October's transactions. September the 30th through today, which is October the 8th. And we're going to see what we did for this week. So for October 30th, I'm sorry, September 30th, I purchased a book. Off of Amazon and this was in my spending category and the amount was $17.91 also on the 30th you will see I did a lot of spending I also purchased some deodorant off of Amazon and that was under toiletries and household and that was a total of $12.69 and I went eating out and this category is eating out And it was $15.88. And on September 30th, again, I went to Home Depot and got some foam. And this is under household. And this was $7.95 for October the 1st, parking, was $4.50 for October the 3rd. And this is another day that I did a lot of spending. Um, I went to Walmart. And I got some soap here. And this is under toiletries. And this was $12.13. And then I got some food. And the Express and me and my mother was hanging out on this day. So I kind of got double the food. And I also purchased some food for someone else. So this was $32.07 on Panda Express. Same day, we went to Popeyes. And this is where I got the food for some oh, for my aunt. And this was Twenty dollars and forty-two cents, but I have the cash. I have the twenty dollars in cash for this transaction. And also unexpectedly, um, epidemic sound. I thought I had canceled it, but I didn't. So this is going to be on. I'll put the name where it. Unbudgeted. 
And this was a total of $15. And I also went to Target. I told you on a couple days this last week was just spending, spending, spending. And I got some more deodorant and soap. I'm just going to put soap there. Some things you just can't find at Walmart. You can find at Target. So that's how that went. And this was $20. And 11 cents. And then on October the 5th, I went to Ali's and spending. And you got a couple cookbooks here. And this was $6.34 because I'm tired of cooking the same thing. I want to learn different recipes and things like that. So I'm, I'm, since I'm going to be in the house more, I can try new things and not eat out as much. And also for October the 5th, this is going to be a grocery one. And it wasn't even, I just bought one item. And that was $3.49 because for some, some almond milk. $3.49 that I spent for week one. I didn't. Okay, guys, so my camera actually cut off, but um, like I stated, I spent $3.49 on some almond milk. So for October, week one and week two, I gave myself $200 to spend. And as you see, I went over by $68.49 for week one. So for we and I have the cash for this twenty dollars and forty two cent from someone else from the person I purchased it for. So I what I did was I subtracted this twenty dollars from the one sixty eight forty nine, what left me remaining for week two is going to be fifty one dollars and fifty one cents. And the only thing that I really need now is just groceries. And I can just use this for at least for the first few days or the first week because I do have groceries. I want to eat what's in my pantry before I go out and spend any money on anything else. So that is it, guys, for my week one check-in. And I will be back with you guys very soon for week two, which is going to go from October the 9th all the way through October the 15th. So, so that is it, guys. I thank you guys for tuning in to my weekly check-in for week one of October. And I will see you guys soon in the next video.